Hi there. My name is Evangelia. My name is Des. Hi, my name is Daniel. And we all belong on the Feedback App team. We all work at Automize, where we develop this application. A little story about this application. In 2017, we were working with a client who had noticed a feedback feature on the ServiceNow support portal that they liked, which was called Hi at the time. It was this always visible little feedback icon to the right of the screen that you could click on and then a model would open and give you the possibility to leave feedback. They wanted the same feature, but this was unfortunately not a standard feature of the service portal, so it was something that we needed to develop. We then asked ourselves, should this be a standard feature? Is this something that most ServiceNow customers would benefit from? And we believe the answer was yes. So we developed the solution and made it available on the ServiceNow App Store for free, so that everybody could enjoy. Today I'm playing the role of a ServiceNow portal user. To do so I have opened the service portal of Automize on my laptop, so let's dive straight in. The first thing I'm going to demonstrate is the way the user can leave feedback of his service portal experience. What I need to do is to click on the feedback button and a very straightforward window will pop up. A default 5 star rating model appears in which I have to import my rating. I can also add a comment and an attachment to explain my feedback. By clicking on send, my feedback becomes available to the feedback app table. Another great feature of the feedback app is that the user has the possibility to report a bug. The way to do that is to click on the bug report button and fill in the information needed. By clicking on send, the bug report gets saved on a table of my choosing. Lastly, a help button is available to quickly guide the user to a get help page of your choosing. The feedback app is highly customizable, meaning that you can change its properties to fit your needs. From the automized feedback footer, you can make the adjustment needed. For example, you can design the placement of the widget. You can decide if you want the help a back button to be visible or not. You can decide the help page you want to open once clicking on the help button, the text appearing on the model, and you can choose the style of the icons between star rating, smileys and thumbs up and down. The table in which the feedback are stored is this. Here you can see information about the feedback, like who submitted the feedback and from where. The URL captures the exact location of the user and you can create an incident, enhancement or defect as well as configuring mail notifications based on the feedback. Feedback app has helped us save time because users can give their feedback really easy and on that way the quality of our services has become much better because we collect all their feedback in one table and we can follow up on feedback to improve customer satisfaction. On that way we can value our services with a simple average score calculation or with some reporting as the one shown here. So let's see what our customers say about Feedback App. So here you have it, that is the Feedback App. With that said, we all want to thank you for your consideration and have a great day.